Hey there, welcome back to World Drum Club. I'm your guest instructor, Dave Holland. Kalani and I thought it'd be big fun to team up on a series of videos we're gonna call Cool Metal Sounds. Now, for our purposes, we're gonna categorize these instruments into three types, one-hit wonders, rhythm makers, and special effects. And we're gonna start with one-hit <laughs> wonders. Now, here are a few of my favorite one-hit wonders. The first few I'd like to show you are those that can either be hit with a single hit or a longer hit and scraped and to create a glissando. Now this one is a simple piece of finished uh, rebar and then on my right we have um, a trine, a coil chime and back here a spiral cymbal. I'll go ahead and zoom in and show you what a single strike sounds like as well as that glissando. So over my left shoulder is a boomy wang. This is made by the Hammer Axe Company, different sizes and different shapes. But the way that it is hammered, it gives you a single hit and then a warble effect afterward. I'll show you what it sounds like. So on this rack to my left, I've assembled a few crashers, splashers, and effect symbols. I'll go ahead and show you what these look like and sound like. Okay, so there you go, a few of my favorite cool metal sounds. Hey, Kalani, show us your one-hit wonders. Thanks, Dave. That's awesome. Thank you so much for sharing those with us. So the first one that I've got is a Peisty 8-inch cup chime. It looks like a splash cymbal, but check it out. And that was with a peck stick. I'm gonna use a mallet. It's kind of a hard rubber mallet just so you can have a different effect. So an awesome sound, it's not quite a splash. It doesn't sound quite like a cymbal. It doesn't sound quite like a gong. It's something else. Peisty eight inch cup chime. Next up in the things that fit on a cymbal stand category, this is a ribbon crasher. Now it's similar to the material that a tape measure would be made out of, but obviously mounted on a stand. And you know the only thing better than a single ribbon crasher is a double ribbon crasher. Check it out. And you can change the effect by rotating the stand. So you can access this from both sides. Ribbon Crasher, very cool. Next up is the Ohm Spring Chime. I did a video on this before, but here it is again. How fun is that? I don't know about you, but I expect to hear the voice of Rod Sterling coming up, just talking about the Twilight Zone. Last up, our good friend, the Bell Tree. Now this one would normally go on a stand. I would not try to hold this like this on a gig. It weighs about 10 pounds. <laughs> but here's what it sounds like.
And like some of the instruments that you shared, Dave, you can strike this individually. Or all together. I think I feel like something magical just happened. Something magical did just happen. You guys got an awesome video from my buddy, Dave Holland. Go check out Dave's work over at Beat and Path Rhythm Events. He's also got some things on Teachers Pay Teachers, great products, books, downloadables. Go check it out. Say hello, show Dave some love, you guys. Thanks for tuning in to World Drum Club. Consider upgrading your fashion with some <laughs> World Drum Club swag by Teespring. It's another way to support the channel. and Get an awesome look. All right, thanks for tuning in. We'll see you in another video. Make sure you like, subscribe, and click that bell so you don't miss any new videos. Thanks for watching.